everyone, welcome to workout nine of the 30 day arm challenge. You're all doing amazing. So we're getting really, uh, really into the workouts now. We've only got a couple left where we're working the arms in this upright position with very light weights and then we're gonna move on to using the stretch band. So um, if you haven't been using weights, now might be a good time to incorporate them um, just so your muscles are ready for that next stage. Um, however, it's entirely up to you. You don't have to if you don't want to. But let's get the wrist circling out and stretching the arms away. So let's get everything moving and waking up. And we're going to give me a reach from side to side. So we're waking up those shoulders. Again, this is a really important one because your shoulders are doing a lot of work now, especially if you're using those weights. But you should be starting to maybe see a bit of definition appearing. Um, and if so, fantastic, well done. Give me a reach up and over. So open out the sides of the body because those big muscles of the back, when we're holding our arms um, up at shoulder height, they're doing a lot of work as well. So you might be finding the back is just starting to react to these exercises too. And we're gonna hold it here. Um, so I'm gonna bend down and pick up my weights. So if you have them, grab yours as well. Now today we're gonna reach both arms out and we're gonna circle both arms from the elbow. So we've done this one a few times now. You should be fairly used to it. We want to keep the elbows lifted and in line with the shoulders. And we want to keep breathing. Nice deep breaths. <sighs> keep your abs tight as well because if your abdominals start to relax, your lower back may kick in and that might make it a bit harder to work because you'll be focusing on your lower back. So you want to just make sure everything is focused on the arms and the shoulders so our posture is nice and even and we're not hunching or slouching. And we're gonna hold it here, and we're gonna punch. Punch those arms, again, nice and forceful. Put all your body weight behind it. Work the tops of those arms. Deep breaths, keep it going. And again, if you want to step one foot forwards, place your weight a little bit, um, more evenly between both feet, you can. Just keep punching, doing really well. We're gonna add in um, a slightly different shoulder one this time. We're gonna reach one arm up, we're gonna push up and out. Up and out, keep reaching. Oh, and keep the other arm lifted. So stretch it away. If it's too much, turn the palm up. That might make it easier to hold. But come on, doing fantastic. Keep pushing, keep reaching. Come on, keep it going. Hold it here, reach that arm out. Other side, let's push. Up and out. Again, palm up if it's easier. But try not to let it bend or drop because that will put weight on the shoulder. Abs tight, come on. Really use them now when it's getting tougher and those arms are starting to burn. Focus on your abs. Keep taking deep breaths, don't hold your breath. Keep breathing. And we're gonna hold them here, we're gonna push up. Both arms together, palms facing forwards. I want you to give me another 10. Really good. Last seven, come on. Five, four, three, two, one, relax, lower your arms. So, weights to the floor. This is our last set of split push-ups. So coming onto your mat, again, you can stay on your knees or come onto your toes. We're gonna aim for eight. So one hand back, one arm forwards. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. That's three. Five, keep it going. One more. And relax, sit back onto your heels, stretch your arms, deep breath. And very slowly rolling up off the floor. 
tucking in the chin. Give me a deep breath in. And remember guys, if you need to, please use our upper body stretching video just to loosen up all those muscles. And you did a really good job, I'll see you tomorrow.